Happening now, renewable energy in Colorado Springs, months away from a major boost, a massive new solar collection site on a fast track for completion by the end of this year. Bill Folsom went to the south end of El Paso County. He brings us the closer look tonight. From the sun to these panels into Colorado Springs, this will eventually serve around 19,000 customers. Solar at a size to serve a city. A utility scale solar project. Tens of thousands of solar panels already installed. More than double what you see still to come for the 500 acre site that will hold nearly 220,000 panels. So it's nine months to go from, uh, you know, an empty field with cows grazing to a, you know, tens of millions of dollars of, uh, of solar energy that's going to serve the, the CSU load. UV, the solar development and construction company, worked with Springs Utilities to pick this site. Relatively flat, off the beaten path, with convenient access to transmission lines. A third company, called Duke Energy Renewables, will own the facility. The owners have access to tax benefits not available to utilities. To monetize those tax credits and pass those savings on to Colorado Springs and ultimately to their customers. If a solar facility is working the way you want it to, you turn it on and it essentially just runs. Within the next two to three years, solar additions will take Colorado Springs up to 20 percent renewable energy production. Integrating every asset that we have in a way that makes sense for our customers. There are political and social pressures toward renewable energy. Customers also give feedback, some commenting on the desire for more renewable. Others worried about affording their utility bill. Utilities leaders also have to factor in reliability. The wrong kind of weather, for example, can drastically cut renewable production. It's why a transition to solar will continue, but with caution. But I can guarantee you that every option that we have is not going to be short-circuited based on the reliability or the affordability of the system. Thousands of panels as far as you can see, but keep in mind this is only about 25% of the total project. It all goes in and should be online by the end of the year. Watching out for you, Colorado Springs, Bill Folsom, News 5.